Mike Losh of Siloam Springs, Arkansas, is not new to the life of creating show-stopping custom builds, having built various other award-winning and magazine-featured vehicles in his past. Mike knows quality, and he also knows what he wants to create when dreaming up a new project. He wanted to design a truck not only to further develop products for his company, Slosh Tubs, but to showcase it with his friends at Precision Replacement Parts at SEMA. Mike's high standards and lofty ambitions immediately sparked when he came across the 65 Chevrolet C10 that he chose to make his starting point for next few years. When he secured the rough-looking 65 in September 2014, he began calling it Bertha, because she was pretty ugly to say the least. All that would change as the transformation began. Every great build must have an equally great base, and that's where the work began. The stock frame rails were boxed and smoothed, and all the porter built components were welded in place and smoothed to eliminate the bolt in look. Having the knowledge of past builds under his build, Mike knew that not only does a truck need to look great, it needs to ride well and be reliable. With that in mind, the front chassis setup started to come together, composed of a porter-built airbagged front drop member with 1-inch narrowed tubular control arms and a porter-built front sway bar. For the front suspension, Slam Specialties bags were chosen with the durable Firestone F9100 sleeve bags in the rear, all of which were given added stability by QA1 adjustable street star shocks in all four corners. After those components were installed, the frame was body worked and painted by Clem Johnson of Tuba Trucks. Since stopping on a dime can be a priceless ability, especially with a full size truck, Mike chose to install an SSBC big brake kit with a massive four piston caliper set. Under that, a large set of cross drilled slash slotted rotors not only enhanced the look of Bertha but the performance as well. A CPP hydro boost brake system was tucked away beneath the dash mount to keep everything functioning as it should. Engine Mast Motor Sports LS408 9.5 to 1 compression Cali's Compstar crank and rods Mayhill 2618 pistons ARP fasteners and studs Mast Black Label LS7 265 heads LSX Turbo Cam Magnuson TVS 2800 Supercharger with custom made intake from Wegner to fit the fast big mouth 102mm throttle body Wegner Complete Front Drive 1,000cc fuel injectors by fuel injection connection B and M starter and flex plate Payformance distributors coils Live wire plug wires Holly Dominator IFA by Brock Payton, Amsoil Fluids, Flex a Light Radiator with Dual Fans, Loker Dipsticks, Throttle Cable, Shifter Cable, Coolant Overflow Tank by Monkey Fabrication, Custom Coil Covers and Air Filter Cover made to match the top of the supercharger made by Trick Manufacturing, Custom Engine Sheet Metal by Mike Losh, Custom Air Intake Built by Mike Losh using K&N Filter and Parts from Sprector Performance. Yeah.